hi guys, welcome back. I know I'm not very good at getting puppy videos out every single week. It just gets really, really busy, but I'm trying my best to get them done. Um, at least one video per litter in the time that we have them. So I have the Welsh Springer Spaniel puppies. This is one of three litters actually that we're gonna have this, this last part of the year. Um, we have two more litters just born in the last couple of days and um, that will be it until probably next summer for the Welsh. So if you guys are interested, please get in touch with us. Go to our website, oshayspringers.com if you wanna see, uh, if you want more information on the Welsh Springer Spaniel puppies that we're gonna have available. Um, these guys are so, so cute. Oh my goodness, wait till you see. What are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? Come on. Hi, Mama. Let's go. Let's go. This way. Hi. Hello, puppies. Oh, my goodness. Where did Mom go? Where did Mom go? Oh, my goodness. Look at them. Isn't that color just extravagant? Even though you don't get a variation in the coloring like the English, this color that you get in the Welsh is striking. These puppies are just, oh my goodness, I can't even handle the color of these puppies. It's just extravagant. And they are, you know, they're so light when they're born and then they darken as they age. Um, but it's just such a gorgeous, gorgeous color. Um, it's just different, it's vibrant. And especially with their white, it just really stands out. It's just, just beautiful. Really? Really? What are you saying? What are you saying? What are you saying? I know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> There's Mama. So you can see she's a little bit darker as she's gotten older. Excuse her thinness just now. She is um, nursing six puppies and she eats a whole ton, but once these puppies stop nursing her, she will gain really, really fast, which is nice. Um, unfortunately, that's just part of when they're raising puppies, they're on the thinner side because all of the calories are going to the babies. But Cora is a smaller female. She is beautiful. She has, oh my gosh, the most amazing personality. I just love how sincere she is. Cora! <laughs> Hi guys. So Cora had six puppies, just beautiful. They're just so, so pretty. Um, you can really see a difference as they, you know, the more litters we're having now, we've had, I think this is our third litter of Welsh fingers that we've had. Um, and we do have two more currently um, on top of what we've had. And just seeing these puppies grow and how different they are from the English. Uh, they're very similar, obviously they've got the spaniel look, but the ears, the shape of the ears is different. The shapes of their faces are different. Um, their little eyes are different their bodies and statures are different. They have different personalities um, compared to the English. And uh, yeah, they're just, mm, they're super, super sweet, sweet puppies. So the dad of this letter is Lomond, which was our newer male that we got. And uh, yeah, when we, we didn't know if he was going to take, or if Cora was gonna take because we didn't, this was the first letter that Lomond had sired and he was pretty young still, so we didn't know if he would manage or not, but yeah, he succeeded. And these guys are, are so cute. They have such sweet, sweet, sweet demeanors. And of course, they're that playful stage. <laughs> so I have color collars on the Welsh. Um, that's how I tell them apart. It's really hard to distinguish between them when their markings are just so, so close. And when their hair is changing, it's growing, um, it's, it's a lot harder, it's a lot more difficult, especially these ones have more um, solid saddles from right from their neck down. There's really not much on their back that's white. Uh, whereas my English over the years, I've been able to memorize their markings and know which puppy's which. And now as these guys are getting older, I can tell from their faces, but 
um, the collars certainly do help when they're running around. I can kind of see the color and then I can go, oh, that's that puppy or that's that puppy. So this is Henry. Oh my goodness, he is so sweet. He's got such a beautiful little temperament. He's just so sensitive and so beautiful. He's a very, very sweet, sweet boy. Aren't you? This is the sweet girl, Ember. Oh my goodness, she's so cute. She's so sweet. I know, I know. She's got kisses. Not some kisses for me. Yes, she would do. This little girl is female number two. She has a blue collar. That's how I remember that. And she has a family, but she doesn't have a name yet. I know. <laughs> female number one. He's the only one in this litter that doesn't have a family yet. And he, oh my goodness, he is a double of his dad. He's so much like Lomond. Um, so cute and so much fun. He's got a, such a beautiful, beautiful face. This is Birdie. Oh my goodness. I can't even handle it. I can't. She is so cute. I love her little sock that she's got going on here. She's so sweet. You a sweet girl too. Yeah, you just want to play with your brothers and sisters, don't you? Yeah. So this little sweet boy is Pepper. I know you're so sweet. What are you doing, Cora? What are you doing? <laughs> My baby? Cora is my baby. Cora is my baby. Cora is my baby. Yes, you're my baby. Yeah. Cora is my baby. <laughs> I know. I know. Cora is my girl. You're my girl. Yes, you are. She's my huggy girl. She's my one who loves to hug, loves to snuggle. The boys just want to run and play. And the girls love to snuggle. My girls love to snuggle, especially Cora. Don't you, Cora? Don't you? Thank you.